gratitude. There's one thing, one quality, I believe will get you what you want faster than anything else. It's gratitude. Living in a state of gratitude, an attitude of gratitude. Tony Robbins talks about this. Everybody talks about it. Living your life in a state of gratitude. And what is gratitude? Because we all think about the things that we love in our life, our kids, our wives, our spouses, everything that we have. But what is it? For me, gratitude is a connection. It's a connection to the divine. It's a, it's a oneness with that that creates everything. And to paraphrase one of my favorite quotes from the book, The Science of Getting Rich, talks about the closer you get to the source of everything and the people that express gratitude, thankfulness for what they have will get more of what they're grateful for. You know, they talk about what we focus on, we create in our life. And so the more often that you can really feel the sense of gratitude, the more you're grateful for will come into your life. And that's the real key. That's the real key. And I would say if there's one thing, one quality, one practice that has created more in my life than anything else, more peace of mind, more love, more of everything good, it's gratitude. Practicing it, and not just practicing it on a superficial surface level, but really feeling it to the point where it's overwhelming, to the point where you start to cry so many times, so many times. I mean, I I'm feeling it right now. I'm in beautiful, beautiful Kona, Hawaii. You know, I'm at, this, I'm at a conference for my wife's business, for our family business, and I'm just, I'm overwhelmed with the gratitude of my life, the, 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 the amazing blessings in my life, my beautiful wife, so beautiful, so ambitious, so strong, so convicted, and my beautiful kids, my family, my relationships, see? You can see it right on, right on camera. That's gratitude. That, thinking about that. It's not about the money, oh, I'm, thanks for, oh, oh, I'm thankful for the money that I have, you know? Oh, I'm thanks for, thanks for my car, you know? And some people even, oh yeah, thanks for my kids, you know? But it's really, it's deeper than just saying it. It's deeper than just writing it down on a piece of paper, what you're grateful for in your life. How many times have we done that? I know I've done it. Just write it down on a piece of paper, you know, as maybe your, your daily morning ritual or something like that. But it's deeper. It's deeper. It's a state of being. And the more often you can get into that state of being, being grateful to the point where it overwhelms you, like you just saw with me. That is a direct connection to God. And when you have that direct connection, more of what you're grateful for will show up in your life. More deeper relationships, more money if you want money, beautiful vacations, you know, anything you want will come into your life in the most magical, spontaneous ways when you practice gratitude just one thing but it is it's like a muscle if you haven't been to the gratitude gym you're gonna have to go you got to start practicing and it and, and and it does start with maybe writing those things down really getting honest about what it is that you really are grateful for and then focusing on that focus let me give you an example Okay, let's say, let's say you want more money. Okay, let's say you want more money in your life, but the money just isn't showing up. The reason why it's not showing up is because even though you want the money, because everybody wants money, everybody, but you're not grateful for what you have right now. You're not grateful for what you have right now. 
You're, you're focusing more on what you don't have, the money, the relationship, the health, whatever it is. You're focused more on that than you are on what you want. When you take the time to really focus on what you have right now in this moment, and you focus on it long enough, that is when you generate the emotion of gratitude. And that is when things start to change. When you're grateful for where you are right here and now, and you focus on that, you get overwhelmed with that sense of gratitude, you do that often enough, you're gonna fill your cup up. And when, you fill, when your cup is full, then your cup will overfill with the things that you want in your life. Live in an attitude of gratitude. No matter where you are right now, you can be grateful for everything that you have.